Hey, everyone, David Hayes and Rod Holloway coming to you from Comprehensive Financial. You know, here we sit in the beginning of August and we had one month year to date that's been decent in the stock market. Interest rates have gone up. Bond values have been down. But of recent, we've seen somewhat of a turnaround. And it doesn't make a lot of sense because basically the Federal Reserve is on a mission to send us into a recession, we, we believe and continue to raise interest rates at the same time the market's rallying and interest rates are coming down. So I wanted, Rod, just to comment on where we are on things today. So, Rod, go ahead. Yeah, sure. Well, you brought up a great point, Dave, and it's exactly what you and I've been discussing here in the last week to two weeks, which the market started this relief rally. We weren't overly surprised. We kind of saw a technical pattern building in which we thought we'd get a relief rally and a couple of these gap downs within the technical pattern would mm -hmm. be filled. We have since filled those. We've moved above them. We're hovering right now right around another point of resistance. But the market most certainly seems to have some momentum. And, and, and I think what is most confusing to me in the short run is if the market is most fearful of inflation and an aggressive Fed, everything that the Fed is still telling us is that inflation hasn't started to go down meaningfully in their eyes. Um, which means they're going to stay engaged and continue to be somewhat aggressive. So if that's what the market dislikes, that's why it's kind of hard to fathom why it's rallying. But at the same time, you and I have discussed, and we've been through many cycles, yep. the market will begin to move before the problems that, that the market perceived to be an issue are fully fixed. Is that what's going on here? That's the difficulty in analyzing and figuring it out. I don't know that as of now. Um, there are many that are trying to claim that, that we've seen peak inflation. The Fed's not one of those claiming it. Now, the Fed also didn't see inflation being a problem. So I don't know that we can put all of our eggs in the basket of what the Fed says, where inflation is at today, and that that is completely accurate outside of the fact that if they don't see inflation subsiding, they're going to continue to increase interest rates. Yeah, and we've seen that before where the Fed has changed directions quickly. So just to reconfirm our processes, we have a purpose behind everything we're doing. And if you would like to talk with your advisor, please reach out to us and we'll make it happen. So have a great rest of the year, folks. Talk to you later.